Peace, y'all. Um, this, this, that, that. I can't speak. Peace, y'all. If this is your first time uh, checking out uh, this page, <clears throat> my name is Bellamy. I'm a musician. And um, yeah, this is primarily a music channel. But uh, I've for a while wanted to just come on and just speak about uh, crypto related topics because that's something that I'm very passionate about as well. Um, so what's up, y'all? My name is Bellamy. Um, if you came here for music, you can like and then skip past the video um, or maybe learn something. If you came here for crypto, maybe you can check out the music too. Um, but you can get all my information in the description below. But make sure you like, comment, uh, whatever. Anyway, <laughs> and I didn't want to do it this way. I'm in a car. Everybody does theirs in a car. Um, Crypto Siege uh, <laughs> and One King in particular. Everybody does. I guess everybody at some point does this stuff in the car. It's because I guess this is where thoughts happen. You get time to think and just listen. So, um, yeah, forgive me for being so cliche, but um, shout out to everybody in the crypto community who just adds value and just gives information and opinions, man, because that's all we're doing, really. We're just having a conversation publicly. So, uh, you know, don't take anything that I say as um, gospel. Uh, do your own research. I don't have any financial experience. Uh, don't do anything based on the things that I say in this video. Um, but I do want to say uh, I've been in the space for, man, I've been following the space since 2016. Yeah, 2016. And I didn't jump in until 2018. Um, up until then, like, I was getting a lot of my information from, you know, just looking up stuff online, reading articles. Um, but the crypto community has been very, it's one of the more active communities. And I'm, I'm really appreciative of, you know, everyone who's involved. I know I'm gonna forget people, but like, I've listened to Digital Asset Investor almost every day for years now. Um, Alex Cobb, Brad Kimes, Jungle Inc., CKJ, um, all of these people were essential in me, like learning and gathering information. What's the other guy's name? He had a really good channel. He would break down the bearable guy stuff. And um, and then he just went off the deep end one day with all this conspiracy stuff. Anyway, his channel was great, loved it. Um, it was two brothers who would always talk uh, two white guys i forget their names but they were dope um working money channel man legal briefs blockchain backer um i'm gonna forget people i love the fact that i see faces like mine in the space uh you know one king crypto siege who i talked about earlier from the car videos um ISO GOAT. Um, we'll just add another to it. Maybe I'll do another video. Anyway, I'm just on here to say uh, to one, give thanks, show my appreciation, and then two, just to say, hey, you guys have inspired me to just share what I think. You know, maybe you listen, maybe you don't. Um, anyway, uh, I first got into crypto in 2018 as um, as an investor. Um, before then, I hadn't purchased any assets at all. So, um, and of course, back then you had to get in Bitcoin to get into anything else, Bitcoin or Ethereum. Binance, I used a lot. Gemini uh, was my preferred method. Um, but yeah, and then uh, you had your other exchanges. The uh, Uphold has been my favorite and cons most consistent. Uphold and BitTrue. Um, so if you want to get in, I suggest going through one of those. Um, I also used to use Ether Delta when I was really trying to get some other stuff and try to come up on some coins that maybe weren't as popular. But, um, you know, that ended up being a dud for me. 
<laughs> I lost tons of money just in transaction fees, which led me to look for other assets and do more research. Um, so, like I say, any you know, people will talk about you know shit coins here and there, but honestly, at the end of the day, I think anything that happens in this space is really just informative and you know being so early like it's just going to help the space grow it's going to help us inform each other a lot better and make better decisions um you know and just we learn along the way and we keep it moving um so it's no need to bash anything uh, that said uh i landed on xrp years ago and probably like for the last two and a half years that's all i've purchased um, and it's all offline for the most part. I keep a little bit on exchanges just to move um, things in and out just as needed. But um, that said, I, the real reason I wanted to make this video is just to say we've been following this lawsuit for a while with Ripple and the SEC. And I just find it so interesting that all of these amicus briefs are coming in now. And yeah, it's just, I don't know, my spidey senses say, uh, something ain't right about this. It feels like a Trojan horse of sorts. Um, but then again, it could also be, hey, I want to be on the winning team, you know, fair weather fans. Hey, I want it to be documented that we were on the right side of things. That could be the case, too. Either way, it just don't sit right with me. Um, convince me otherwise. Um, yeah. Hopefully everything goes well. It doesn't really affect my my feelings about the asset itself. It doesn't really affect or change anything about my investment strategy. Um, but it just is like, uh, I don't know, I don't trust it. We're smiling now. Um, and hopefully we continue to. I hope I'm wrong as hell. And if we find out later information and you remember this video, just come back and comment below, dude, you were wrong. And I'll eat that, whatever. But um, it just don't sit right with me. I just, yeah, let's talk about it. Anyway, um, if you came here for music and you just stumbled upon a crypto video, you know, maybe you've learned something, maybe you're intrigued, maybe you'll do some research of your own. Uh, if you came here for crypto, hey, I mostly do music, so check that out. It's dope. You'll like it, I guarantee. And if you don't, tell me how much you hate it in the comments. And press that like and subscribe button so you can keep telling me how much you don't like it. Anyway, um, it's Bella Me, y'all. I'm out. Speak life. Peace.